Hi there, everybody. Welcome to the home of Norwich City, Carrow Road. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Well, here we are on the 31st of October, Halloween. Hoping to have a celebration game. A lot of the fans are here in costumes on this uh, special date. Norwich City against Sheffield United. Yeah, hopefully we are in for a treat, maybe a trick or two uh, on that pitch. There's certainly enough skillful players out there today. Now the game has started. Here is the Norwich City team for you today. The system that we think they're going to go with is 4-5-1. That one striker will need a bit of support. Yeah, you do not want him to be left isolated. Otherwise, this formation will not work. Oliver Norwood. Well, they come here, the visitors, with this wonderful defensive record. Actually, it is the best defensive record in the division. Well, they've got some good individuals at the back, and they've also got great understanding across that back line. Well, that's what they've been looking for, the ball in behind. Oh, it's a great goal! I'm sure the manager will be delighted with this. Fantastic teamwork, lovely ball through. Sheffield United with the lead. Got his body in front of the opponent and protected the ball well. Work on the ball here is good from O'Connell. And they're looking good when they get the ball out. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems, and certainly not the goalkeeper. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. Impressive in possession. To level it up now. Well, there's the equaliser. And a really good start to the game. It's always thrilling when both teams show that they can score in a match. I wonder where we'll go from here. Well, it must be great to be a striker in this team when you've got this sort of approach play. And the setup for him was super. Well, it was. And I think as a striker, you know the chance is going to keep on coming. And that gives you an awful amount of confidence. And he showed it there. So away we go at one all. Now, can they move on from this wide area where there is room? Here's Robinson. Swung into the box. That was catching practice for the goalkeeper. That's cut out. It goes out wide again. Basham. Very good tackle. Wasn't critical to get it there, but it's helpful. John Fleck. Norwood. Patient play from them, with good vision. He wants to shoot, you can see that. Can put them in front here, and he's done just that. Oh, they've laid down a marker with that goal. Really good finish. This really is a team game, and that shows the value of team play. Several players involved, great passing, great movement on and off the ball. And a super goal. Yeah, it was, the, the way he shifted the ball on. It was, it was great team play, Martin, you're right. It's Sheffield United in front. Want to keep possession, that's the way they play, but they're not doing it.
to really get at the opposition here. Threading it through to get the equaliser, and it's the equaliser here. Oh, I always used to love scoring these type of goals. When you're there first, it feels good, this. Extraordinary game here. Two very well-matched teams, and they're trading goal for goal in the game. And it's O'Connell. The, well, the signal's gone up for two minutes. A minimum of two minutes of added time. Marco Stiepermann. Leitner. Lots to talk about at half-time with the referee signalling for that now. And it's... It's the start now of the second half. And this is going to be a throw. Lewis. So easy in possession. Game still level, but the pressure might be counting. Saw that coming and intercepted. On the attack here. Good stop by the goalkeeper. Leitner. Marco Stiepermann. Return pass. Well, here it is. Into the lead here. What a big goal that might turn out to be. Well, it was a decent move, and to get some space in a crowded penalty area. Well, he's allowed uh, three substitutes, and two of them coming on together here. Well, plenty of goals here today, 3-2. Going forward well. He's got support in the centre. Saw the pass and dealt with it. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. <laughs> Referee played advantage here. That's a free kick against Sheffield United. Oh, that's late. He's going to have to get booked for that, I'm sure. Yeah, a silly challenge. And, uh, you know, if he ends up getting sent off, he's only got himself to blame. Moritz Leitner. Blocked off the pass there. Morrison. Now, I think we've seen it. The visitors controlling possession. And they've got him behind here. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Well, they managed to dig themselves out of a pretty deep hole then. It was a great chance, I thought, but they're safe again. This could be promising. Men in there to try to convert this cross. No nonsense defending, it was needed. Might just be in here from that little chip pass. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Marco Stiepermann. Saved, but not decisively.
And it's O'Connell. Norwood. Work on the ball here is good from O'Connell. Cuts it out nicely. Norwood. Oliver Norwood. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. And that's really the way to get the ball out of the danger zone. Can they hang on to this one goal lead? The fans are trying to play their part in it happening. Yeah, and it's the approach that the home team take that will be important. Got to finish here. Just rushed it a little bit. Could have relaxed a bit more. Yeah, and he seemed to be off balance when he hit it. Morrison. Oliver Norwood. We've got two added minutes. That's been signaled now. Well, there's still a chance. They've got to keep this attack sharp and maybe they'll break back. There we are, final whistle. Well, they played very well when they had the ball, which wasn't that often. Um, but they played even better when they didn't have the ball to stop the opposition. Yeah, that's right. It was the old wham-bam when they did have it. They used it extremely well and clinical in the end.